It might have come a few weeks later than originally planned, but the Bears finally got to take on the Cougars under the Friday night lights in Coventry, and it ended up being more than worth waiting for. The hosts came into the game off the back of an incredible comeback against Hunslet, while the Cougars had just battered Tabletopper's Barrow, although were looking to put a stop to an abysmal run of away form. The match was also played on Bears head coach Rich Squires' birthday, and his side ended up giving him the perfect present with a mature, disciplined and accomplished performance. After a bright start, the Bears took the lead in the seventh minute when halfback Dan Coates threw a sublime sidestep to open up the Cougars' defence and score. <laughs> Ten minutes later, the home side scored again. They chanced their arm on a final tackle and worked hard to keep the ball alive, before eventually popping it to rampaging centre Liam Wellham, who arced in from 20 metres and was not going to be stopped for anyone. Credit to Keithley, they hit back five minutes later with their first meaningful attack of the game. After some slick hands and some good work through the middle, centre Charlie Graham found a way through to stab the ball down. But the Bears weren't to be shaken and refused to let their control of the game slip. They showed a cool head on an otherwise hot night to keep the scoreboard moving in their favour, with Coates kicking two penalties in quick succession, despite them being awarded in promising positions. The closest the Cougars came to threatening a comeback was in the five minutes either side of half time, when flying winger Phoenix Laulutongai scored two tries. The first, a terrific finish in the corner after some scintillating handling from his teammates, and the second, another good finish after yet more champagne rugby from the Keithley line. But that was as close as they got, and the Bears effectively sealed the win with two tries in the space of three minutes just before the hour. The first came courtesy of a clever grubber from Dave Scott that Keith Lee couldn't deal with, much to the delight of prop Darius Hamilton, who gleefully scored his first professional try. You'll struggle to find a more popular scorer all season. Moments later, the icing on Rich Squires' birthday cake came courtesy of Sam Bowring who seemed to be the only man on the pitch who reacted to Coates' bounce ball and scooped up the ball to score, and added a nice nod to that basketball pass in his celebration. From then on, the Bears worked hard to manage the game and see out the remaining quarter. Keithley kept plugging away, but were kept out either by dogged Bears defence or unforced handling errors, often both within the same passage of play. The Cougars did get the last say when Moagoro scored in the corner with the final play of the game, but it meant little in the grand scheme of things and only flattered the scoreline in the visitors' favour. Back-to-back wins then for the first time in 21 for the Bears and just what their coach would have wanted for his birthday.